Welcome back to art, everybody. Today, we're taking an image that I copied through the color printer, and we're going to transfer that onto our already primed or gessoed canvas using a soft gel medium. Let's take a look at the video. This time, I opted for a soft gel matte medium, but a hard gel matte medium will also work. You'll need a canvas, you'll need obviously your image, and brush, running water, and a hair dryer. This canvas that I'm using has already been primed, but a raw canvas also works. Brush the soft gel matte medium onto the area of the canvas where the image needs to be, remembering that the image will come out in reverse. You might want to consider this when using text. Perhaps flip the text before you print it up. A little trick I have is to pop a box or a book underneath the canvas to provide a firm base for the massage. The canvas can be quite bouncy, so it's nice to have something solid underneath. I used a brayer here, but it really isn't necessary. You can leave your image to dry naturally, or if you're impatient like me, you can use a hairdryer and speed up the process. When it's dried, you will feel it, and the image will be secure on the canvas. This is when you can run it under the water. You notice here that you can start seeing the image come through, and this is when you start rubbing off the paper. Use a sponge to help you get rid of some of those white bits. I use warm water here. Because I'm impatient, I want the process to speed up and I use a hairdryer to help dry it. Now at the end, if my image is not as clear or as poppy as I would like, I put an acrylic gloss on top and that finishes it off nicely. The image is now transferred onto the canvas and you are able to draw on it, paint on it, add to it, varnish it, whatever you like. Or you might just want to leave it as is.